Outside the offices of a UKIP parliamentary candidate in Rotherham this morning, local people, trade unionists and even some breastfeeding mums had choice words for the people inside. Maggie Thatcher in disguise. Watching from behind the blinds inside Jane Collins' office, Mr Nigel Farage. Safely indoors on police advice, brushing off any concerns. I get this everywhere I go. I mean, UKIP, uh, UKIP um, for some reason, uh, there are big trade unions in Britain that want to fund a campaign to stop UKIP speaking, and that's not in keeping with our parliamentary divisions. Mr Farage had come to open the campaign office in the town, but many say he is exploiting the abuse scandal there, as his visit comes after a damning report into the way Rotherham Council failed to deal with child sexual exploitation. Uh, we think it's important that Farage isn't allowed to just get his usual media coverage without any criticism. We think that Farage has come here today to try and make political capital out of the child abuse that's taken place in Rotherham. Defending his visit, Mr Farage says Rotherham needs fresh politics. We've got, on May the 7th here, a third of the council seats are up for election. Uh, why not have the whole lot up for election? And why don't we break up the cabinet form of government locally which leads people to be very suspicious that things are being decided and kept behind closed doors. Much like Mr Farage himself, who did manage to get out of the office under an umbrella and surrounded by security. Singita Candola, 5 News.